everybody, it's Mandy from Mandy Jean Chic. I wanted to do a really fun tag that I found on YouTube. And it's called the... The Movies Tag. I love movies. I love TV shows. I get sucked into them. So I thought this tag would be really fun. I actually saw it on the Sammy Maria Show channel, which I'll include her link below. I, um, I've been watching her for quite a while. And I, I like her as a YouTuber. But... I'll go through, there are 22 questions, so I'll try to get through these pretty quickly. The first question is, favorite movie of all time? Forrest Gump would definitely be one of them. I love Forrest Gump. I love Tom Hanks, but I love Forrest Gump. Favorite scene from that movie? From Forrest Gump? God, I just, I love the whole movie, but I think my favorite scene is when Forrest is, um, when he's in D.C. and they're having the Vietnam protests. And he sees Jenny, and Jenny sees him, and they, like, run towards each other in the in the water. And I just, like, that's what I think about when I think of love. It's like, I want to find my forest. You know, like, that's... Everybody should have their forest, or everybody should have their Jenny. I think, like, three of the greatest love stories ever are Forrest and Jenny, Johnny Cash and June Carter, and the married couple from Up. Favorite actor, actor and actresses. Favorite actresses, I love Jennifer Aniston. Uh, I've always loved Jennifer Aniston. I'm a friends girl. <sighs> Other female actresses, I don't really have any that like... I love Meryl Streep. But I don't really have any that I just like, every time they come out with a movie, you have to watch it. I do have some favorite actors though. Robin Williams will always be one of my favorite actors. Tom Hanks is brilliant. Mark Harmon. Patrick Swayze will always be one of my favorite actors too. You know, he he's he's gone too soon. I just, I love a lot of the older actors. I don't care for many of the newer actors now at all. I don't even really follow some of their movies. Most annoying actor or actresses. I don't like the drama queens. I just, I don't. I'm not going to name names or anything like that, but I just don't enjoy some of the younger actors and actresses now. I just, I, I think some of the stuff that they're doing is crap. Um, I don't think that they're taking being a role model very seriously. I just, I'm not a huge fan of some of the newer actors and actresses. Best director? I don't really have one, honestly. Like, I don't really follow movies like that, like, who they're directed by. Uh, you know, some people bash, like, Quentin Tarantino because they think his movies are kind of, you know, off-kilter or weird. I can kind of see that, but I also think that they're kind of cool. I like Tim Burton a lot, also. Just because I love Edward Scissorhands. <laughs> Favorite guilty pleasure film? Mm -hmm. I consider like a lot of my favorite movies like guilty pleasures because I watch them, you know, for one reason or another. Either I'm sad or I'm upset or I need to laugh. I will never turn off Joe Dirt. If Joe Dirt comes on on TV, I will watch Joe Dirt. Joe Dirt, the Saw movies. I I liked the Saw movies. I know I think I'm like the only person ever that actually liked the Saw movies. Paranormal Activity movies. I've liked all of those, all four of them. Rocky Horror Picture Show will always be one of my favorite movies. Favorite tearjerker. I hate tearjerker movies, I hate being sad, but um, A Walk to Remember with Mandy Moore like affected me for life. A Walk to Remember Up was like the beginning of it, and anyone who's ever seen Up knows exactly what I'm talking about, I still cry every single time. Forrest Gump is kind of a tearjerker too at the end. Especially when his mom died, God. Jenny dies, ah! A character from a movie that scared you the most. Uh, I love scary movies to a point. They freak me out. Like, I can't sleep. So if I have somebody that's like, you gonna stay with me and stuff like that, then I'm fine. But if I'm like watching a scary movie alone, no. The House of Wax freaked me out. Hmm. Paranormal movies mess with my head really bad. So I'd say probably paranormal movies. Movie you, you love, everyone hates. Joe Dirt and Tommy Boy. Um, I love Tommy Boy. I love Chris Farley. Chris Farley also was one of my favorite actors. I think he was so funny, so brilliant. Again, lost way too soon. Movie you hate, everyone loves. Uh, The Notebook. I think, I, I just, I don't get it. Like, I don't understand the whole, why everybody loves The Notebook. I couldn't even sit through the, the movie. The Notebook and a lot of serious movies. And then movies that are about, like, the world ending. I don't want to watch that. That's a little, like, too close for home. Favorite movie duo? Uh, Chris Farley and David Spade. Hands down. Favorite movie duo ever. Loved them. Favorite animated movie? That would be Despicable Me 1 and 2 and up. I freaking love Despicable Me. If I could have minions, I would. Favorite movie villain? 
Probably Maleficent. I really liked that movie. What movie surprised you the most? I don't know. Like, I don't really watch a whole lot of movies that I don't think I'm gonna like. Because I just... Or... I just... I'm, I'm not like that. I, I watch movies that I like. Like, I love comedy, so I watch a lot of comedies. Did Django surprise me at how much I actually despised that movie? I, I did not like Django at all. And also, I didn't care for The Great Gatsby. Mm-mm. -mm. And I, I like Leo, but I, I didn't care for the great guests. If you could only keep one movie, what would it be? And if it was like a movie I had to watch over and over and over again, it would be Up. Ooh, so, such a tie between Up and like Despicable Me 1 and 2. But when that new Minions movie comes out, oh, I'm like so sure it's gonna be my favorite movie ever. I'm gonna have to find someone's kid so I can take it to the movies. Movie recommendation and for whom? I don't know, like, I don't really talk about movies with people a lot, because I think they know, like, I'm more into music. One movie that I think everybody should see for a good laugh would be Tu Wong Fu, Thanks for Everything, Julie Newmar. And the reason why I say that is because it has um, Patrick Swayze, John Leguizamo, is it Wesley Snipes? I think it's Wesley Snipes. And they dress in drag. And it's just, it's a really funny movie. I, I like, I love Patrick Swayze, so... I love Patrick Swayze in anything. What was the uh, the last movie that he like last dance that he made with his wife before shortly before his diagnosis with cancer? Oh my gosh! Like that movie is really good too. If you could go back in time and marry an actor from back when, now old, who would it be? I love older actors. Oh, the first one that pops into my head is Dean Martin because I love Dean Martin and I've had a crush on Dean Martin since I was like a wee little Amanda. Hmm, Dean Martin. I love Mark Harmon. God, I would marry Mark Harmon in a minute. I would still marry Mark Harmon in a minute. <laughs> um, young Jack Lemon was like so funny. Young Walter Matthau. I love those two together. That would be another favorite comedy duo would be Walter Matthau and Jack Lemon. Grumpy Old Men and Grumpy Old Men. So funny. One remake you wish had never been made. I didn't care for the remake of Footloose, honestly. I I love Julian Hogue, but I just, I didn't care for it. I did like Blake Shelton's version of Footloose, like the song, but I didn't care for the actual movie. About to die, but could only watch one more movie, what would it be? Just Wiggle Me 1 and 2, because then I get to watch two movies. <laughs> Hopefully it'll give me time to, like, not die. Favorite movie genre, or favorite movie from that genre? My favorite mov my favorite genre is comedies. Like, I love to laugh. If I'm going to sit there for two hours, I want to laugh. What is the first movie you remember watching in theaters? The first movie I remember watching in theaters, and I know it wasn't the first movie that I remember that I watched, but it was, like, Rudolph or something. We went on Thanksgiving. I didn't like the movie. I, it sucked. I, I was too young to go to movies. But that is my movies tag. If you want to do this tag, I tag you. Uh, feel free to film it. Let me know if you do because I would love to check it out because I love, you know, good movie recommendations. If you enjoyed my tag video, give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe. Bye! There it goes. Isn't that pretty? Like, 